What's going on out there, people of YouTube? I'm Walter Jones. And I'm Jones for Movies. So you'll see behind me, I got my Nika figures. I know that Mr. Matthew Movies wanted to check them out. So between other movies and stuff, I'm just going to be putting small tchotchke stuff or movies that I have here. Just a little background uh, noise so you're not just staring at this uh, beautiful mug here. So today I got this really cool thing. I don't have the t-shirt for it, but I have... I think to date now, um, all the Cauldron films that are that are released, and one actually was sent to me. I mean, it paid for. It wasn't sorry. Was shipped to me. That is actually, I guess, technically not supposed to be released until like next month. So cool that they sent it to me. Pretty excited. And I'll just start it off. And these are Cauldron Films is a new boutique label. And the first one here is American Rickshaw. And uh, let me just set these over here like I like to lean out of frame a little bit. So here's American Rickshaw, the cover there. Sorry for the glare, like I say every time. This is Sergio Martino, which I didn't realize that it was Sergio Martino. I just had just talked about those two Arrow films as well as his. And it's a 2K scan from the camera negative. Uh, interviews with, you know, I'll just do this. Just check that out. Look at that. See it in all its glory. A couple shots there. I thought this was going to be like, uh, you know, crazy, like Kung Fu action. And it's not, it's more of like a, a drama, you know, there's like, there's like, uh, a little bit of fighting in it, but it's more of a drama. So I was like really surprised. Uh, Mitch Gaylord, Daniel Green, Victoria Prouty, and uh, Donald Pleasance is in this. So, uh, I'm pretty sure, no, I thought it had reversible art. It does not. Here's the disc right here. This is the only one I've watched out of these so far, and I really enjoyed it. So I'm really excited to, to check out all these other ones. And all these all these other ones are still in the wrap. So this is the 002 title from Cauldron, and that is Abracadabra. Zoom that out a little bit. And it is a film by Luciano Onetti and Nicholas Onetti, the Onetti brothers, I guess. I'll just put that there so you can check out the special features. Hopefully you can see that, there's not too much glare. Hopefully I can show you all the stuff in here. I think I can. So what the eye see, sees and the ear hears, the mind believes. So like that real close up on my face right there. Arr. So that's uh, the second one in the uh, stack. And like I said, I have, uh, I have up to the most recent. Third one is called Beyond Terror. I mean, look at that cover art. That's just like, like there's zombies, there's motorcycles. There's my wife sneezing in the background in another room. My wife sneezes and people in other aisles in the grocery store are like, bless you. I sneeze just like her too, so I got no room to talk here. So this has, not, there's not too much uh, special features. It was a 4K restoration from the original camera negative, an image gallery, and oh, this one had, does have reversible cover. So, beyond terror. Uh, let's see. Their nightmare was further than fear. It was beyond terror. There's the tagline. I'm just going to spit out the taglines. You can go to cauldronfilms.com and purchase these. Peruse them at your leisure. The next one is The Crimes of the Black Cat. This is number four, I believe. Yeah. And uh, this one looks cool. I think it's a Jallo. I mean, I see a, I see gloves on the bottom there. So that tells me it's a, it's a Jallo. Nine lives fueled by murder. So, uh... Who, who did this? I don't I don't know who directed this thing. Sergio Pastore. So there's the special features. There's some pictures there. Hopefully they're they're cool, cool, cool to cool to be shown. So uh, the next one, and I'm really excited about this. And this is a a film by Victor uh, Dreyer, and this is Le Possession de Altier, 1974. And I want to say this movie actually came, yeah, this is from 2016. I forgot to mention so the, the year these movies came out, you know, because they have them right on the back, which is cool. Here's a spine number two if you're interested, and that's five, right? Zero, zero, five. Yeah, zero, zero, five. Got the little cauldron guy there. Let's see if it'll focus. Nope, let me uh, set that over there. Let's see, if I can, see if I can do... I don't... I don't know how to focus that. Just, okay, enough of that. Enough of seeing my mouth and just that. So yeah, not much on the back. 
uh, sound design feature at trailer CD soundtrack is in this. That's a special feature. So there's a, there's a little, a little hit and miss on these special features I'm seeing. All right. So the next one is number, number 006. And that is the Collinswood story. Haven't checked this out. I believe this is on a streaming service. So if you go to like the Just Watch website, you could probably find uh, where it is. I don't know why I'm so close to the camera today. It's kind of insane. Uh, 006, Mike Costanza film, a revolutionary experiment in the supernatural. Actually a really cool cover. I just didn't, that's cool. It would've been cool if this was like a lenticular thing, but you know, that's all right. Uh, 2002, 82 minutes, unrated. Here's the special features if you're interested. So these next two are the ones I actually received today and because uh, I got them off the website because I actually, because most of these are the ones I got from Amazon or I found in the wild. Uh, but but these two I actually picked up off the uh, Cauldron Films, not Criterion, Cauldron Films. And this is a Lucio Fulci film and it's called Contraband. And this is the, uh, there's two covers. This is the B side, the B cover. You could get it in the A cover, which I guess is the same. But I thought this one looked cool. Here's the back. And this one, and because I got it off the thing, the website, uh, this actually has a slip case. So I don't even know I, I, what the inside of this looks like. And I can't tell you any any aspects of it at all. But it's Lucio Fulci, so, you know, check it. I know the trailer's out there somewhere. And uh, so I can't wait to crack into this. I, I kind of want to go in order of how they release them. So, like, Abracadabra, then so on and so forth. But uh, I really want to really want to check out that uh, that Fulci film. All right, up next is a uh, Murder in a Blue World, and that is by Eloy de la Iglesia. Again, I don't know what year it is. Nice, uh, nice blood drop on the back. Here's the front cover. Kind of another motorcycle. What is the deal with motorcycles? Uh, I think uh, yeah, this is zero zero eight. So, so I found this one actually in the wild. Uh, and I guess this one is maybe out of, it's not out of print, but it's uh, its uh, sold out on the website. So you might have to go on Amazon or find it in the wild. Um, and this is a uh, Seder. Sorry about the glare again. Uh, after you have suffered, he will find you. Uh, behind the scenes, there's director commentary and trailer. 2019, 85 minutes, unrated. So, be interesting. I think there's a folk horror film, so... And the last one, number 10, there's two more. You can pre-order them on the Codron Films website. But this is the last one in the thing, uh, in the, the numbers. This is number 10, and this is Lisa the Fox Fairy. What a cool-looking cover, man. I'll be honest. I really, really dig it. Um, yeah, it's uh, 010, or 010, I mean. Uh, the suitor's only rival is death. That is the tagline, which is a pretty great tagline. Uh, here's the special features and some pictures you're so interested and inclined to check them out and uh yeah so i'm really excited you know to uh, check out the other ones like i said i've only watched american red sean i really enjoyed it i'll probably do a down dirty uh, movie review uh like i did with the lamb on that so you know stay tuned for that down the road uh yeah that's it that's all i have i just wanted to show you guys this i have uh, still some shout factory or scream factory the from the shocktober cell and uh i think i have a shirt coming from cauldron and a few more packages that are just like in shipping delays. So once I get those, I'll show them off. Uh, stay tuned for movie reviews and all that other good stuff. Good and plenty that, that, uh, that I do. So thanks for sticking with me. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out. Appreciate it. Uh, like this video if you're so inclined. Comment down below. Have you seen any of these films? If so, what have you seen? What do you think? Have you seen American Rickshaw? Tell me about it down below. All right. I'm out of here. Later.